Hello, we are at the Antelope Island State Park Visitor Center where we have an aquarium that hosts some brine shrimp. Uh, or some of you may recognize these as sea monkeys. <laughs> they are one and the same. Great Salt Lake, as you can imagine, is a very difficult environment to live in uh, with the very high salinity levels and the wide swinging of the temperature of the water. Uh, it's, it's tough for most organisms to survive. But these guys have uh, really adapted very well. Uh, they have a great filtration system so that when they're feeding, that salt water goes in. Uh, the salt is filtered out through their gills uh, so that that doesn't go through their digestive tract. Uh, also, brine shrimp are able to either give live birth in prime conditions or they can lay eggs when conditions maybe aren't so great. If the water temperature gets to be too low, uh, if oxygen levels are too low or food levels are too low, they're able to lay eggs. And those eggs can lay dormant until those conditions improve uh, and then they, they will hatch. These are key players in our total ecosystem in Great Salt Lake. Uh, they're an essential food source for millions of migratory birds that stop here. Uh, and also, in a human perspective, in the fall and winter, they support a multi-million dollar commercial egg harvest. Uh, their eggs are used for fish and shrimp. Uh, so if you come out to Great Salt Lake or Antelope Island and walk down to the water, take a good close look. You'll be able to see these guys in the water really well. Um, or, of course, come into the visitor center and check them out.